heels of the massive success of Guardians of the Galaxy, Marvel Studios appears to be looking at other risky comic characters as it's being reported that they have a finished script for Inhumans. Add on top of that, Vin Diesel also recently teased on Facebook that I get a strange feeling that Marvel thinks I'm Inhuman. Christian buy or sell that Marvel will actually make an Inhumans film. I am Inhuman. Um, <laughs> I will, as far as the question is, if they will make it, I will buy it. I'm going to say I think they will make this movie. and I, for the, They are still a studio. They are a successful studio. And they also pay attention to what is working. People obviously reached out and said, sci-fi, uh, fantasy, a space opera. It, it worked. If they are confident with their property and they like the script, I would absolutely buy this will happen. As far as me wanting it to happen, I'm also going to buy that as well because they have proven with Guardians of the Galaxy, as the man sitting to my right has seen it seven, seven times, times. Can, can tell you that there is an absolute market for this sci-fi. That's more of a opera. commentary on my lack of a life. <laughs> but but it not, even goofing around, though, this fact that you're, as we all know, you're a diehard Star Wars fan. This maybe, uh, besides the fact that you love the movie, it filled a little bit of a void for you in the fact of waiting for episode seven. Yep, you get absolutely. This, space, this movie could do the same thing, mm -hmm. and Marvel has a team that can do it. We don't know what's going to happen with Ant-Man yet, but so far they've been on a tear. So, yeah, why not? Amy Rose? Yeah, I buy that. It could happen as well. It would make a lot of sense. And <laughs> Vin, I love Vin. He always does this to us. Mm -hmm. Like, is he going to be 15 different characters? All this misdirection and everything. Um, this is a pretty direct correlation to this. So I don't know what to believe out of him. But I would like to see him in another property like this. And you're right. After the success of Guardians, we talked about this months and months before it was released, that it was a risky property to release. And now that, again, they continue hitting that hot stride, I have complete utmost confidence in them, and I think bringing more obscure properties like this would be very, very beneficial to, again, continue <laughs> to expand that universe and bring us some more amazing characters. So I'm into it. I'm, I'm actually going to very, 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 on, a, on the thinnest of margins, I'm going to sell this. I, I think just because I do believe the script exists, but remember, they also have a script for The Runaways. They also have mm -hmm. a script for a lot of things. I'm sure they've developed scripts. To, to, they've probably got 100 different scripts of different characters that they may not get around to. Vin Diesel making that little comment, that, that makes you go. But I will admit, my, uh, my me saying sell is probably influenced by the fact that I wouldn't even want it. Mm. I, I gotta admit, I never really read Inhumans until about a year ago when people first started talking about, hey, maybe they should do Inhumans. So I thought, I, I mean, I've seen a couple of the Inhumans pop up in Avengers and X-Men here and there. But when I picked up and started reading, I, I, I gotta admit, Hey, look, just because you're a comic book fan doesn't mean you like every comic. I, I'm not really all that into it, and I just don't see how Inhumans fits, in, fits comfortably, at least anyway, into this Marvel galaxy they've been setting up. So personally, I wouldn't even want them to do it, but that's just me. Dennis, what do you think? I'm going to buy it. And you're talking about how risky Guardians was. We talked about that a lot this past year. I can't believe in, in our own comment section, people are saying, oh, it wasn't a risk at all. Yeah, hundred yeah, yeah. seventy <laughs> million dollar movie. That's yeah. just the production budget, sure. not the marketing and all that stuff. Not a risk. Yeah, sure. Why not? But but yeah, I, I'll, I'll take in humans. They have a back history with um, Ronan the Accuser, and hopefully they maybe oh, yeah. they'll yeah. tie that in. As far as Vin Diesel, though, I mean, he's he's kind of played around with us a lot. He has. Yeah. Showing us pictures of him and a certain character, or him and talking about this thing. Remember we put up that picture on his Facebook page of Vision? And yeah, everybody go, oh, exactly. he's going to be Vision! So yeah. I don't know if he's actually going to play Inhuman, <laughs> but I think, uh, I think a movie might be good. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.